Hey everybody, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to use ChatGPT to describe images by simply inputting a URL. Right, so if you want to describe images inside ChatGPT, you have to use a plugin. And in this example, I'm going to use the Pixel of ChatGPT plugin. So if you're not familiar with this plugin and you want to learn more about the plugin, of course, I'm going to show you how to use it right now. But if you want to get some more use cases and uh, some more information about this plugin, like the best plugin prompts, you can use the Pixel Low plugin. I have a full tutorial on this plugin that you can check out by using the link in the description below. And you can also get access to a complete database of all currently available ChatGPT plugins that can be installed from the ChatGPT plugin store. You can search this plugin database by category, plugin name, description, and get quick access to ChatGPT plugin video tutorials, the best use cases and prompts for all available ChatGPT plugins. The database can be downloaded for free, but you can also support the maintenance and the frequent updates of the database with a small donation. Any support is appreciated. You can get access to this database by using the link in the description below. But now let's see how to use the Pixello ChatGPT plugin. So first, before you would be able to enable the Pixello plugin, you have to enable the plugins feature in your ChatGPT account. And to be able to do that, you have to have a ChatGPT Plus subscription. Then you have to click on new chat on the top left corner, then select GPT-4 from the model selector and select plugins from the plugins list then click on this down arrow and if the pixel plugin is not installed for you you have to scroll down and click on plugin store and search for the pixel of chat gpt plugin install it if you haven't used the pixel plugin before you also have to create a free pixel account uh, it's absolutely free to do so basically you just have to add an email address and a password and then you will be redirected back to chat gpt and kind of be able to use the pixel of chat gpt plugin so we're going to use a really simple prompt to demonstrate that this plugin can describe images. As you can see, all I had to add is describe the image in detail. Of course, you can be more nuanced in your image description prompt. But now this is just going to be a really simple and direct prompt. And then all we had to add is the URL of the image. The image we're going to use is this image. So as you can see, a woman is doing something at an ATM machine. And all you have to do is to get the URL of the image you want ChatGPT to get you an image description. And you can get any image URL by right clicking on the image and selecting copy image address. So if you want to describe an image that is on your computer, first you have to upload it to a public image sharing website. There are a ton of websites like this on the internet, so you can use any of them. And once you have copy pasted the URL, all we have to do is click on send message. If the plugin is enabled, ChatGPT is clever enough to know that if it wants to describe the image we have linked in detail, it has to use the Pixel or ChatGPT plugin because by default, without this plugin, it doesn't have the capability to describe images. But with this plugin, it can. So as you can see in a request, it has sent the URL of that image. And based on that, URL, the Pixel plugin was able to describe the image. So as you can see, the image portrays a woman using an ATM machine. She seems to be in the process of withdrawing money or perhaps checking her account balance. Standing next to her, a man is looking on, possibly waiting for his turn or accompanying the woman. So as you have seen a minute ago, this is exactly what the image portrays. So this is a great description of this image. As I mentioned, you can add more details in your ChatGPT prompt. So you can ask what kind of clothes they are wearing, what is the dominant color on the image, what text can be read on the image and stuff like that. So this is a really useful plugin. There's also another plugin that does pretty much the same. It's called Scene Explain. I also have a video tutorial on that. So if you're interested in, in that other plugin, you can also test that image description ChatGPT plugin. But all in all, this is how to use the Pixel Low ChatGPT plugin to describe images inside ChatGPT. If you want to learn more about other ChatGPT plugins that can be used for finance, business, marketing, SEO, cryptocurrency, scientific research and more. I have a ton of ChatGPT plugin tutorials on my YouTube channel and more are coming up so make sure to subscribe. And also if you want to get access to the complete ChatGPT plugin database that includes categories, searchable descriptions and more, you can also find the link to that in the video description below.